hello everyone and welcome to neat mentor so finally they have added the missing seats and uh, if you look at the seat details now it looks uh, more positive okay so with the help of this uh, seat increment we can definitely see a positive shift in the government colleges okay so if you are new here please do subscribe this channel and uh, if you are still looking for the support in the counseling process which includes choice filling your customized choice filling for all the rounds uh, round level suggestion how you can manage multiple counselings for government suppose state level counselling and all india counselling in case you are looking for the private seats then uh, more counsellings you might need to participate into then how you can achieve the best possible seat for those things you can take our counselling guidance packages so this is the seat matrix analysis in 2023 there were totally 12,273 seats okay when the seat matrix was released first time they had reduced the number of seats okay but now ultimately the missing seats are added up and totally now 12,761 12, seats okay so 488 seats are there uh, additional in comparison with the last year and if you take a look at uh, um, the details about the other seats in dimmed university and diploma so 488 seats additional in comparison with the last year and uh, 10 seats in uh, central inst institutes are added in dimmed university 537 seats in uh, dnb 494 seats in diploma 114 seats we are still expecting that more seats will be added up in dnb and diploma as we had done the analysis in the previous videos, I have mentioned that particularly in Diploma and Family Medicine, they have reduced the seat. Okay, it's not reduction of the seat. It's just like they have missed the seats due to some regions. Okay, they will add it further. So we have like so much, a time, so much of time still left for the choice filling. It's going to end on 17th. Okay. So meanwhile, you can expect more seats in DNB and Diploma. Okay, so totally 1643 seats are added up now. And if you look at the figure that the government said 4000 plus seats will be added up in the PG courses for this year. If you leave uh, 500 seats for other courses which is not uh, through NEET PG counselling then still 3.5 thousand seats okay. Out of that 1600 plus seats are already added up. More seats will be added up in the private colleges at the state level where you can just get the seat through the state level counselling and uh, 488 seats are added up in the government colleges so same number of seat you can expect through the state counseling including all the states so 500 more seats through state level counseling so it's coming around 2.1 and uh, around 12 to 1500 seats you can expect in the private colleges where you can get the seat through state level counseling okay so ultimately it's coming around 3.5 okay that's where uh, the government has given the figure the government data won't be wrong because they need to give the proof okay so there is nothing panic and uh, more seats we can expect in diploma and dnb if not then this round then in further round you can get uh, more seats okay and uh, you should uh, now do the choice filling with the proper mindset that there will be definitely a positive shift okay because initially people thought that less number of seats so it might not be uh, positive shift but now definitely a positive shift and uh, so if you need any kind of help in the choice filling okay so uh, you can take our support and guidance so that's all from my side thanks for watching have a nice day